Okay, so after I filed my rehearing brief, the court posted the uh, word remitted or issue. And me, uh, being lame, not knowing what the word meant, I had to go look it up. And this is what it came back. Remitted or is a term which finds the meaning of uh, context of a jury verdict uh, it renders to let's see to a judge order reducing a judgment award by a jury when it exceeds the amount asking the plaintiff remitter is a process by the jurisdiction and is transferred back from the appeal court to the lower court. Okay, so Remitter means they're going to send your case back to the lower court from the appeal. Meaning that they agree with you, uh, something was wrong, their mistake was made, your constitutional due process was violated, the 14th and the 5th Amendment, because that's what mine's about, the fraud in the case, and them violating my uh, 5th and 14th Amendment. And therefore, they apparently agree with me that I am correct and that the case needs to be sent back. The way I know that is that because at the top there it, it talks about a uh, judgment award by the jury. And in my case, there is no judgment award by the jury. It's the simple fact that the judge overlooked my evidence, or I should say ignored my evidence. That's Judge Ruth Ann Kwan. Judge Ruth Ann Kwan ignored my evidence. And then Shepard Mullen and the attorney for Shepard Mullen, which was Jason W. Kurgan, intentionally gave misleading false information to the uh, Judge Ruth Ann Kwan about the material facts in my case. And he never brought forth any witness or evidence to prove uh, any statement that he made. And if you look up Trinzi versus Pacalero, an attorney cannot make statements uh, and, the, and the judge accepted as facts. So that's where we're at in mind. So apparently they agree with me. They're going to do their thing to try and prove that I'm wrong. And they got 30 days to do that. So this is where we're at in my case. The remitter issue. And uh, again, this is fraud upon a court by an officer of the court, Shepard Mullen, Jason W. Kerrigan, and a corrupt judge, Ruth Ann Kwan. That's at the uh, courthouse downtown at 11 North Hill, where a lot of those judges are very corrupt, taking money. If you don't believe me, Google uh, Richard Fine. F-I-N-E, Richard Fine. And uh, judges down there put him in jail and stripped him of his license because he uh, reported back that the judges had been taking bribery money for over 10 years. They locked him up for 18 months. Nobody knew where he was. Look him up, Richard Fine. 